Chapter 1 Computer An Electronic Device A computer can perform a variety of tasks. You must wonder how computers work. In this chapter, we shall get the answer to this big question. What is computer and how does it work? A computer is an electronic machine that takes data and instructions as input, processes the data and gives the result as output. A computer works in the following way. You enter the data and instructions into the computer using the input devices. This is called input. Instructions tell the computer what to do with the data. The computer works on the input data with the help of CPU. This is called processing. After processing the data, the computer gives results on the output devices. This is called output. Let us understand input process output with the help of a few examples. Input Process Output Humans and Computers The design and working of computers have been inspired by human body. We humans sense our surroundings through our sensory organs such as eyes, ears, nose, tongue, etc. Similarly, computer takes inputs through mouse, keyboard, scanner, and web camera, etc. We speak with our mouth and write, paint, and draw using our hands. Computers generate output through monitor, printer, and speakers, etc. Our brain helps us understand and process the facts. The processor of the computer controls other devices and processes the data. This way, functioning of human body closely resembles that of computers. Advantages of Computers Let us see the advantages of computers. Computers are fast. Computers think very fast. Processor of a computer can perform billions of calculations in a second. Computers do not make mistakes. Computers are accurate in calculations if input given to them is correct. Computers are efficient. Computers can perform a variety of tasks at the same time. For example, you can play a game on computer while listening to music on it. Computers do not get tired. Computers can work for longer hours without any break. They do not get bored doing the same task again and again. Computers store a lot of data. Computers can store a lot of data. One computer can store a lot of movies, songs, reports and other files. Computers are programmable. We can store instructions in the computer as programs. Every time we need to perform a task, we run the desired program to do it. Limitations of computers While computers offer remarkable advantages, they have certain limitations also. Let us have a look at them. Computers do not have self-intelligence. Computers can only follow exact instructions. They cannot think and decide about anything on their own. Computers cannot learn. Computers cannot learn and remember like we do. For the same problem to solve again, they need the same instructions again. Computers cannot express emotions. Have you seen any computer happy or angry or crying? Computers do not have emotions and feelings. Computers need human care. Computers need to be maintained by human beings. They will not work properly if humans do not take good care of them. Disadvantages of Computers Virus Threats Today, everyone uses computers to access the Internet. Internet is a source of several threats like viruses and malwares. Viruses also spread by sharing infected pen drives and disks. We should use antivirus software and make careful use of Internet. Online Threats On Internet, hackers can break into our computers to steal important information. We should never share our passwords and important information with anyone. We should avoid downloading games from unknown websites. We should not talk to strangers online. We should inform our parents immediately if we see any threat on the computer. Threat to Environment Computer parts are harmful for environment. When computer parts are broken, they are difficult to recycle. 
Recycling means making a waste part useful again. Waste parts of a computer or electronic device are called electronic waste or e-waste.